Sophia Momodo claims Davido's sister trying to kidnap Ime de Diadosa when she was three months old. Davido and his ex-lover Sophia have recently been subject of media discourse in a court over child custody. They seem to feel emotion through Olani Arije and Oke Bara, his lawyers, at the Lagos High Court on April 17, 2024. He sought a court order granting him unfiltered and unrestricted access to Imede, who is aged nine. The video said he has been responsible for Imede's education, housing, transportation, living expenses, health care, and periodic travel. He, however, expressed concern that Sophia has been causing him emotional distress with her utopian demands. He alleged that she also once denied him access to their daughter for up to two years. Last month, Momodu responded to Davido's lawsuit, arguing that she has never denied the singer access to their daughter, although her legal representative, Konuka Atonis and Soridator, and Bimpe Ajabomogun and Co. She claimed Davido repeatedly threatened to make her life miserable if she did not make herself available to him surgery. In a legal document dated June 26, Sophia alleged that Davido conveyed with his sister to try and kidnap three months old Imede out of Nigeria. Momodu claimed Davido's sister trying to take her daughter away from me permanently under the gush of a holiday. She revealed that it took the intervention of the immigration service to rescue Imede from Davido's sister. Sitting the incident, Sophia argued that the singer was not fit to be a father. Her narration partly read, the applicant has demonstrated that he is not a fit father. He, in consent with his father and sister, has tried on many occasions to kidnap our daughter and take her outside Nigeria and or out of my reach without my consent. That at one time, when our daughter was just three months old, she was kidnapped by his sister under the pretense that she was being taken on holidays by her whispering day, we are planning to take our daughter out of the country and out of my reach permanently. Due to the intervention of the Nigerian Immigration Service, she was intercepted at the airport and apprehended for falsely representing herself as our daughter's mother before they could leave the country. Though ensuring the safe return of our daughter to my custody. Guys, this is the end of this video. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, go now and subscribe. See you guys in my next video. Bye bye.